Hello and welcome to the in-depth guide of storage containers in Escape from Tarkov. This video includes the containers used for creating extra space in your stash and also the containers that you would be bringing into the raid. If you're looking for a specific container, check out the timestamps down below or the video timeline. Lucky Sky Junk Box is any Tarkov player's best friend. It is a 16 slot container, providing 196 slots worth of space for all barter items. Overall, this is probably the first container any player should be looking to get their hands on at the beginning of every single wipe. Lucky Sky Junk Box is sold by Therapist Level 1 for 1.1 million rubles, but it can also be traded for 100 level 10 or above dog tags from level 2 therapist alternatively this can also be crafted in your hideout from laboratory level 2 for metal cutting scissors three mag cases six bolts three keck tapes and five metal spare parts the item case is the most sought after container in escape from tarkov this is a 15 slot container also containing 196 slots worth of space it can contain every single item in tarkov except the following item case weapons case lucky sky junk box thick weapons case thick item case and unpacked ammo this is hands down the most valuable container in Escape from Tarkov. You can obtain one by completing therapist quest called Private Clinic. These are the two barters from therapist for the thick item case. Do your own calculations to decide which one is cheaper to barter for. Item case is sold by level 3 therapist for 20,000 euros. It provides 64 slots while taking 16 slots. Item case can store everything except item case, weapon case, lucky sky junk box, thick item case, thick weapon case, pistol case and unpacked ammo. There are two barters for the item case on the screen right now. Both barters are from level 3 therapist. If you're going for the case, best way would probably be the ophthalmoscope and pile of meds barter if you can get your hands on the items at a decent price point. Before we continue, thank you for all the support and helping me reach 2000 subscribers. If you haven't yet subscribed, I would greatly appreciate it if you did. Road to 3000 subscribers has just begun. Let's see if we can hit that before the end of September. Once again, big thanks and let's check out the rest of these storage containers. Thick weapon case provides 90 slots while only taking 10 slots. You can only store weapons, ammunition and weapon mods in a thick weapon case. One can be obtained after completing the quest perfect mediator. It's a great tool for every weapon hoarder in Escape from Tarkov. I certainly am a bit of a collector myself and that's why I have three of them. Two butters for a thick weapon case. First one is from level 4 mechanic after completing task chemistry closet for 20 bitcoin and 20 gp coin. Second one is from Jaeger level 4 for two weapon cases, four ammunition cases and 10 metal spare parts. I bought it all mine from Jaeger level 4. Just make sure you aren't buying weapon cases required for the barter from Flea, but instead barter them from level 3 mechanic. Weapon case provides 50 slots worth of space while only taking 10 slots. Only weapons, ammunition and weapon mods can be stored in it. You can obtain 3 of these total from quests. 2 from Jaeger after completing Huntsman Path Part 1 and Hunter and one from Peacekeeper after completing Special Equipment. There are a total of 4 barters for the weapon case. Skier level 4, Mechanic level 2 and Mechanic level 3 and Jaeger level 4. I personally would recommend the Mechanic Level 3 barter for 8 electric motors, 15 bundles of wires, 4 broken LCDs and 1 phased array element. Medicine case provides 49 slots in exchange for 9 slots. It's sold by Therapist Level 3 for 548,000 rubles. As the name states, it can only store medicine and medical supplies. You can obtain 3 medicine cases by completing following quests. Healthcare Privacy Part 5 colleagues part 3 and crisis medicine case can also be bartered from therapist level 2 for seven medical blood sets seven disposable syringes two vaseline and four medical tools grenade case provides 64 slots while taking up nine slots in your stash you can store all the grenades grenade fuses and grenade launcher cartridges one of these will be rewarded after completing the task chemicals part 4 you can barter for the grenade case from jaeger level 3 it's also available to be crafted in laboratory level 2 for one metal cutting scissors two metal fuel tanks five screw nuts five bolts and two metal spare parts just make sure to empty the fuel tanks before using them for crafting to save some money grenade case is also available on flea market for around 320,000 rubles mr holodelnik thermal bag provides 64 slots while taking up nine holodelnik is used to store all food items in escape from tarkov you can obtain one through barter from jaeger level 2 for 10 cans of hot rod five cans of tar cola, five cans of herring, and five cans of squash. Magazine case provides 49 slots while taking up six slots. It is sold by Mechanic Level 3 for 280,000 rubles after completing Shooter Born in Heaven. As the name suggests, it stores magazines. Magazine case can also be crafted in Lavatory Level 2 for metal cutting scissors, 
two expeditionary fuel tanks, four bolts, and four screw nuts. When crafting, you can also use zero out of 60 fuel tanks to get more value out of this craft. While searching on a flea market, you can filter and untick the box show only functional items to save some cash. Ammunition case provides 49 slots while only taking up four slots. It only stores ammunition and is sold by mechanic level two for 182,000 rubles. It can be found in mark rooms and on the industrial shelf in warehouse three in customs and a total of five can be obtained through quests, two after completing Gunsmith Part 10, two after completing B Customer, and one after completing Samples. You can also barter for ammunition case from Mechanic Level 1 for two cans of thermite and two Eagle Gun Powders. Money case provides 49 slots for money, but it can also contain GP coins and big coins. It only takes up six slots in your stash. Money case can be obtained through barter from Level 4 Therapist for five gold chains, two rollers, and two skull rings. Pistol case provides 12 slots while taking out 4 slots. It can hold pistols, magazines, and ammunition. You can obtain a total of 3 pistol cases as quest rewards after completing the Punisher Part 5, Cargo X Part 1, and Farming Part 4. Pistol case is also available through barter from Therapist Level 2 for 6 piles of meds and 4 disposable syringes. It is also available on flea market, usually for around 100 to 150,000 rubles. Documents case provides 16 slots while only taking up two slots. Documents case is crucial to get as early as possible since you can save a lot of space in your secure container. It can hold any currency, GP coin, info items such as intelligence folder, diaries, SSD drives, etc. Key card holder case, keys and key cards, maps, bitcoins and Veritas guitar picks. Two documents cases can be obtained as rewards after completing the Punisher Part 5 and Nostalgia. It is also possible to find documents case in mark rooms and around the giving tree behind the old gas station and also on the industrial shelf in Warehouse 3 in Customs. Documents case can be bartered from level 2 therapist for one cat figurine, one bronze lion and four horse figurines. Sick organizational pouch aka the sick case provides 25 slots while taking up only two slots. For me personally, this is the next step after getting the documents case. It can hold pro kill medallion, currency, dog tags, score rings, GP coins, key keys and key cards, bitcoins, flash drives, and Veritas guitar picks. You can obtain sick cases through level 4 barter from Jaeger for 12 paracords, 15 duct tapes, 15 insulating tapes, and 15 packs of nails. I highly recommend going for at least one sick case when you have the chance. Key tool is a single slot item providing 16 slots for keys only. It can be found in marked rooms and behind the old gas station under the giving tree and on the industrial shelf in warehouse 3 on customs. You can also barter for it at level 2 therapist for 10 hydrogen, 10 saline, and 10 packs of chlorine. Key tool goes for around 1 million rubles on flea market. Injector case provides nine slots for stimulators while taking up only one slot. It can be found in Mart Room or behind old gas station under the giving tree and on the industrial shelf in Warehouse 3 in Customs. It is also available through barter from level 4 therapist for 20 medical tools, 15 disposable syringes and 12 bottles of hydrogen. Injector case costs around 1.1 million rubles on flea market. Key card holder case provides nine slots while only taking up one slot. It can be purchased from therapist level 3 for 508,000 rubles. It can only store key cards and it can be found in Mart Rooms and under the giving tree at the old gas station and also on the industrial shelf in warehouse 3 in customs. Shinji's keychain provides four slots while taking up only one slot. Can only store keys. It's found in mart rooms and under the giving tree behind the old gas station and on the industrial shelf in warehouse 3 in customs. Simple wallet provides four slots for key cards and currency while taking up only one slot. It can be found in mart rooms but most commonly found in the pockets of scavs. Wheeler's wallet provides four slots for key cards and currency while only taking up one slot. It can be found in mark rooms and behind the old gas station under the giving tree and on the industrial shelf in Warehouse 3 in Customs. Last but not least, we have the dog tag case. It provides 100 slots while only taking up one slot. It can only store dog tags and is sold by Therapist Level 1 for 344,000 rubles. You can also barter for it from Jaeger Level 1 for 3 flash drives. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos and have a good day.